Hi everybody, Joe Brancato, the Airgun Scientist. Today's topic, bipods. We've got the Atlas line here, by the way, Maine, America. And we're going to go through the uh, various models and their applications, which one we think is best for each situation. Uh, one of our biggest sellers is the BT65LW17. This is uh, the middle of the line uh, for the, for the uh, Atlas bipods, by the way. And let's take a look at it here on an on a, on a Impact M3. Now, the legs are easily extended and contracted, OK? Also, what's nice about and that's so smooth when you want to go up and down, or it's like butter. I mean, that's what really sold me on this. When, when people come in, they say, oh, yeah, I've got the Chinese knockoff. And, and when they tell me the price, I'm like, wow, that's pretty inexpensive. But when they feel the quality, they go, whoa, that's really nice. And it showed me that, yeah, you can get things cheap, and that's what they are. They just break after a few short while, and you're not saving money in the long run. The Atlas bipods, seriously, are like two sheets of glass with oil in between moving. They're just so smooth. It, I, wish you, I wish you had feel -a vision on this. OK, now, the particular model we're looking at here, again, the BT. 65 LW17. Okay, it has 45 degrees of cant. That means you can get this little lever here, which tightens it up that way, and you can cant it. So if you're on a on a hill, actually, I'll tell you what I use this for. When we're shooting a, a gun in, because we sight our rifles in when you purchase, I actually make this leg long. I cant it over, and that uh, keeps me as close to the edge, so I don't hit my table when I'm shooting. <laughs> Believe it or not. But if you had uneven terrain is why you would use that, OK? Another reason. Or like I said, if you're just trying to do something unique. Now, like I said, 45 degrees of cant. And there's various, OK, you've got 0 degrees, 45, 90, 135, and then 180, OK? Now, it also uh, extends from 5.1 inches to 9.4. So that's your height here versus your height here. OK? Now, the other model is the BT-10 LW-17. What's the difference? OK, as you noticed, we said this one has cant. The BT-10 LW-17 has cant and pan ability. Pan is like this with a camera, when you pan a camera, OK? So that one, you can, you'd have to move this. It's not a big deal. But if you wanted to, you, would, you can pan on the other model, OK, the BT-10 LW-17. And with that one, you get 30 degrees of pan and 30 degrees of cant. You get a little bit less cant because the pan takes up some of it. Uh, both of them come with this quick disconnect for your Picatinny, and I strongly suggest that. You can get it without, don't. And the reason why is uh, they usually don't fit in a case when you put a bipod on, and it's so easy just to flick a lever and uh, take it off and put it on. So that's the way we sell 90% of ours, 95% of ours. Uh, people get it with the, uh, the quick disconnect for the, uh, the Picatinny rail. The third model is significant. Now, these go between uh, 280 and 300 bucks, depending upon the model you want. Uh, and basically, it's the more width on the legs is where the price starts to go up. It's a little bit beefier, a little bit bigger. Uh, they're all smooth. Uh, like I say, they're, they're like glass, two sheets of glass with oil in between them. The next one here is the BT-35. Now, the BT-35 is the ultimate uh, bipod. It's huge, but it gives you some real width. If you want to be able to really spread those legs out for real stability, this is the piece. Again, simple to, to extend the legs. That's ah, so smooth. This is just amazing, OK? Just amazing. And you have your, uh, let's see, this would be cant. Yeah, cant. So, and then you have, um, you have 30 degrees of pan and 30 degrees of cant. So both. And again, you got the, the, the 0, the 45, the 90, the 135, and the 180. 
and your footprint can go from 14 and a half to 19 and a half uh, with the elevation of five and a half to 10 and a half. So that you can see right there, and that, that's got some severe stability there with that nice big wide leg. You know, that, look at that. I mean, that's, that's not going to go anywhere. We will also talk about the AccuTac in our next video. So hit us up on uh, the little bell that lets you be notified of our videos, and then you'll know when we start talking in comparison to the AccuTac. All are made in America. The quality is, bar none, the best. These are USA-made things. Buy American, there's a reason. You keep good quality, and you keep Americans employed. This is Joe Broncato saying take care, God bless, and again, Remember, hit that little bell to get notified of our latest videos. Cheers.